Hello there, my fellow Doom Slayer player. As you can already know from the title, today I'll be helping you on deciding on what towers to buy in Doom Spire Defense. This video will be split into three different sections. First is for the newer players, second is for the intermediate players, and third is for the better players. Oh, and before we get started, just remember that these are my opinions! So don't go into my comments and go, Oh, you just said this and not this, because if you do, then... Alright, anyway, uh, let's, let's go start the video, I guess. So, what tower should you buy as a beginner? Well, I highly recommend buying either Slingshotter, Swordmaster, or Paintballer. If you get all three of those, you can probably solo normal mode. Why do I think this? Well, it's because Paintballer can be used to kill tankier enemies, while Swordmaster can be used to kill weaker and more faster enemies. Alright, so what tower should you buy as an intermediate player? Well, I highly recommend that you get Rocketeer, then Mr. Tix, and then after you get both of those towers, get Arsenal. With these, uh, you can probably solo normal mode by yourself now. Of course, like last time, I'm gonna be telling you why these towers can help you solo normal mode. First off, is Rocketeer. It has insane damage output, but it is quite expensive. Um, Arsenal, it can be used as a DPS tower, and it's pretty good for cloaked enemies. Although, it can also be quite expensive. In Mr. Tix, it is very important to bring this tower since it gives you a lot of money once you max them out, which allows you to get um, more expensive towers way more early than usual. Now, for the better players. Now, I'm not really sure since most players at this level probably know what they should buy, but if I did have to give them a recommendation, then it would probably be Heavy Gunner, Pizza Place, then Rockstar, and probably Spawn too. Now, remember this. You cannot solo hard mode with these towers only. You need a general and some good strategies to be able to solo hard mode. So I recommend bringing a team to beat hard mode. And, you, and I also recommend that you play hard mode on the graveyard map. Cause um, I don't know, um, people just play on that, that for some reason. I, I, I don't know. 